The great AOC, perhaps the biggest communist in Congress, has randomly decided that she is now super curious in what sort of political content you like to enjoy on the internet. Which podcasts are you listening to? Which accounts are you subscribing to? Um, I'm interested, like genuinely. Let me know which one specifically, which accounts, which podcasts, etc. Now, pardon me for one moment, but I personally question her genuine sincerity here. I have a hard time believing that she's just looking for some podcast or YouTube video recommendations, some easy listening perhaps. I don't buy it. What seems a little bit more likely to me is that she's up to something a little bit more sinister here. That maybe she's looking to put together a list of right-wing content creators so that she can try to censor them. Why do I think that? Well... We're going to have to figure out how we reign in our media environment so that you can't just spew disinformation and misinformation. It's one thing to have differing opinions, but um, it's another thing entirely to just say things that are false. Um, and so that's something that we're looking into. And now I have to say, it is so incredibly ironic to hear AOC talk about misinformation when just one day after a bullet hit Trump in the head, she started saying things like this. Donald Trump is also very old and a racist and a neo-Nazi. But anyways, I'm not even gonna talk about Trump right now. And this is the exact type of misinformation coming from a sitting member of Congress, mind you, that radicalizes people into doing terrible things in real life. But she has quite a long track record of saying things like this. In fact, this was her reaction to Trump winning the election just a few days ago. Donald Trump has talked about turning the military on U.S. citizens that he deems his domestic political enemies. Yeah, Trump is going to turn the military on U.S. citizens. This lady is crazy, and she wants to censor what you watch on the internet, what type of political content you get to watch on the internet. She wants to control how you think. But you know what? She's actually not the first crazy progressive lady to try to do this. If the platforms, whether it's Facebook or Twitter X or uh, Instagram or TikTok, whatever they are, if they don't moderate uh, and monitor the content, uh, we lose total control. And so what is so pathetic is that rather than having some introspection after the great progressive loss of 2024 and realizing that their platform is insane, they just want to double down on it and censor everybody that disagrees with them which is why I appreciate your support so incredibly much. So if you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. Please drop a comment. Please subscribe. That is huge. Please check the description of the video to find my links for X and Kick. Follow me there. I live stream every single day. Thank you for watching. And as always, stay safe.